Let's see if at least this will work. Stream now. Okay, so this one is working. We're going to go ahead and do this on this guy on stream now. I'm not able to get the live events to work as I want them to. Apologize for that. That's okay. I'm not really expecting a big audience here. Uh, let me go ahead and put in. No, let's just go for it. So if you guys are watching here and uh, live or after the fact, hey guys, I'm John from IncomeMesh.com. This is a quick little impromptu video. I wanted to cover the new Breezy Block Kit, the Block Kit 2.0. And to do that, I've got a little story to share with you. I met an amazing gentleman, a lovely, lovely man uh, who runs a consulting company. He's you know very successful in my local area. Um, good guy. So I want to help him out and I'm going to do things the total wrong way <laughs> here live. Uh, so we just sat down and had some coffee, and really it wasn't even intended to be a business meeting, but we kind of hit it off, and he found out about me and what I do with marketing and how we've kind of grown things on my wife's website, and so he's looking for pretty much his online presence to get kicked off kind of from scratch, or you know, he's got a very small setup, doesn't even have a website yet or a professional email address, and he serves very high-ticket clients, only needs a few clients at a time, so it could be a really fun um, project for me to help out with. And I thought, wouldn't this be lovely if I go ahead and just kind of give him something from scratch without him really asking for it, uh, partly as a goodwill thing and also because I really want to test out the new Breezy Block layout, and this might be the perfect project for it. So if you don't know what I'm talking about when I say Breezy Block layout, let's go ahead and show you um, what we're talking about here. It's really, really nice. I'm going to come into my installed plugins, do a quick update down here. Um, so Breezy is the one of the page builders, one of the newer ones coming out. It's a competitor to Elementor and Thrive Architect and all of that. And if you can hear me and see me, by the way, now that I'm streaming live here, go ahead and leave in the chat that you can hear me and you can see me. I'm going to kick over here to my comments so I can see what's going on. And let me just open that in the browser. All right, so if you can hear me and see me, please put that in the chat so I know that I'm not just talking to myself and we'll keep rolling here. Okay, cool. Hey, Kent, how's it going, man? Hey, Fernando. All right, perfect. Um, had a bit of an issue trying to get it going with uh, the YouTube events, so we'll figure that out as we go along here. Nobody's perfect, we're all learning. Okay, so Breezy, uh, it's an awesome, awesome page builder. It's not one that I've used. Um, professionally that much. I've built my mom's website. I built a few websites on it, uh, but it's one of those where it's just kind of always been stuck in the growing pains. This update may be one that kind of pushes it over the edge to where it could be used on more professional applications. And in today's video, what I want to do is let me just start sharing my screen here. Let's do monitor and face. Okay. So I've pulled up um, a very blank website. I haven't done anything with this one yet. I love working on clean websites. Oh my goodness. There's no technical debt you have to clean up here. Uh, and let's just build him a very quick idea of a website to get his uh, juices flowing and to help him, my new little client here, uh, figure out what he wants to do on his web presence. So let's call this Vigilant Services Home. And let's just publish a page here and we'll give you a quick review of the new features inside of the block kit as we're going along. And let's just let that save and edit with Breezy. One of the things that's nice about Breezy, if you if you did hop on on the lifetime deal, which by the way, you can get at IncomeMesh.com slash B-R-I-Z-Y, Breezy. Uh, one of the nice things is they have white labeling, white label featuring. So if you are doing this professionally, like I'm gonna do for this client here, uh, you can get a nice, uh, it, it can be called your actual agency services instead of Breezy, which kind of makes it more professional looking. All right, here we are. So you'll notice when you go into the plus button, and you start building your page, it's gonna offer you to, oh, these are beautiful, to pull out uh, any of the different sections you want for your page. And I'm just gonna scroll through here a little bit while we're here live. Uh, some of these are the first I've uh, first that I've seen them, uh, and they're very, very attractive uh, layout. You can tell they did a lot of work on these. And what's great about this is if you like this layout but the color scheme is off, Breezy has done a great job with their global colors to where you can pull this in and you'll be able to keep it on brand pretty much instantaneously. They have also 
magically made it to where you can have a light or a dark version of any block. So if you like this uh, little hero section here, you can toggle it between light and dark, see which one you like more for your particular application, and then you can import it with a single click. So I wanna build out kind of a, a hero, a home page here for my new client. And let's assume, I wanna find something that's gonna look about right. And let's say we'll start with, let's see. So we can uh, drop it down by categories, hero sections, feature sections, contact gallery, testimonials, pricing, et cetera. Let's start out with the hero section. This is gonna help me focus in on what it is that I really want to do here. And I like, it's a little bit hard to choose. Like before, I would always go to the same hero section because it wasn't really the best selection. But this one is really interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and choose this guy here. Really nice looking icons here. Is this shadow actually brought in? This is probably just the image, right? There's no way. Okay, that's just the image. It looks really nice. So a beautiful, beautiful homepage here. Let me just check the chat, see if everything's going okay here. All right, perfect. So, all right, so how I generate 100,000 visitors per month without spending on ads, but this guy is going to be kind of in the real estate construction business. So let's say how to uh, simplify and scale your real estate management processes. We'll certainly be doing some work on the copywriting, but now let's take a look at these colors. So here you have different styles and it looks like they've added more styles as well to their projects. And with a single click, oh, I might have him come on live. Where's little buddy? Little buddy just got home from school. You can come here and quickly pick out a color scheme. This is fantastic if a client is brand new and doesn't have a web presence like this uh, because you can use a pre-built uh, color scheme or if you saw my video on glorify app where it can kind of help you with the branding process and picking out some nice color schemes you can take that uh, entire branding icon set or you know branding styling and pull those guys here onto the color palette so those tools would work really well together i'm gonna go here with the exquisite i don't think uh, this gentleman has a color scheme at the moment uh, so let me just kind of walk through this and put in some other blocks here Underneath a hero section, I like to have a little bit of a features. And we can do this guy, but let's make it a dark. So we pull this in. Okay, so already we kind of need to do a little bit of work here, don't we? This is a, not a very good transition. But what we could do very easily is come over to this section, come to our settings, under the more settings, down here, this color. We should be able to just make that blend in nicer and now i'm happy but we just need to add some more padding down here and now i have a pretty nice looking section they've also added a really nice visibility icon here where if let's say for example if we go to our tablet or mobile setup if for whatever reason you want to hide something if it doesn't look very good on mobile you can come here and quickly hide that image or hide the entire block just like that. And now when you go through, you'll be able to very easily, very intuitively uh, set up the website the way that you really want it to look. All right. And then to undo it, I think I can just click this guy down here and it will show me all the blurred out icons of things that are currently hidden. And I can bada bing, bada boom, pull them back as I need them. This is very intuitive. You know, recently I've definitely been using Elementor for the majority of the work I'm doing. Uh, it is more full featured, it has more functionality built in, but when you use something that's kind of newer and fresh like Breezy, you can really tell, you can really feel it, and it just uh, just feels good. Uh, so you can see some really cool things here, how they're using different alignment settings, and I think they're doing that by changing whether it's top aligned, middle aligned, or bottom aligned, just a really, really quality looking thing here. Come on in. Everything okay picking up? Yeah. Awesome. It was locked on there, but it's okay. <laughs> I uh, got my times mixed up on picking up my son. <laughs> Not a good thing.
<laughs> All right, so um, the blocks are a fantastic way to go in. And if you're not a good designer like myself, I like the marketing strategy, but in terms of making things look like they just fit and they're cohesive, I still have room to grow in that myself. But the benefit here is they kind of do all the work for you. So we can add this section in here and even the dark to the light, kind of the, the bouncing from dark to light, even that works well because the design of these different uh, layout blocks here. You'll also notice the typography is a heading two and any other heading two like this one here is going to keep the same font type, sizing, styling, all sorts of cool stuff here. I mean, this is a fun builder to use. Uh, it's Again, it's, it's not for the deepest of functionality just yet. Uh, their theme builder is still really to come. You can build headers. Let's build a quick header here by, let's just add a section in between, make a header, and let's make a simple dark header. We'll just do this one for now. And then to pull that up to the top, I can just click on this guy here and drag him up. And then I can create my menu items here in the WordPress dashboard like usual. Very easy to use. Uh, you like what you see when you, when you get it done. Um, if you're looking for a huge WooCommerce site and a lot of different integrations and functionality, you might pass on Breezy at this point. But if you do like to just design websites for people, uh, it's harder to get easier than it's this is about as easy as it gets all right can't have a good one man Alrighty, so let me go through and just give you a brief little tour of the different block layouts we have so far we'll just take a look kind of feature by feature here so then we can toggle light so under the features they've given you a lot of different ways to show it let's add this one in as well and so what's cool is when you're looking at it in the preview mode, it looks totally different because of the color scheme. But when you pull it in, like from here to there, it's really nice how it respects the, you know, the colors of what you're doing here. All right, the other thing you can do, I just wanna show you, if you're working with a, a website from scratch, you might also consider going straight into their layout packs here. So for example, the advisors is a consultant set up website and so not only they're going to give you a single block that looks great they're going to be able to give you the entire web page basically and if it works for you you could be done in a couple minutes with your client you can set up a services page a pricing plan a contact page etc so if we import this we'll also replace our global styling now underneath what i have built you can see it's going to roll directly into this page here now Really slick. So when you compare Breezy to Elementor, I, I'll be honest with you, uh, there it's getting harder to tell the difference in terms of functionality. Elementor is still moving ahead. They've got things like the motion effects and different parallax and more integrations. Uh, for if you're an extreme professional, Elementor is going to be the page bill you want to use at this point. But in terms of cranking out good looking websites quickly, uh, Breezy is really starting to pick up and maybe pass it in certain areas as well. The user interface is just fun. It kind of just works the way you want it to work. And the team is dedicated to it as well. So I'm going to sign off on this one here. I'm going to build out a web page and I'll do a pre-recorded YouTube video of what it looks like. But if you're interested in looking at Breezy, please you know consider using my affiliate link. It's incomemesh.com slash breezy and that'll help support the channel as well as you know support this company and creating some really awesome websites all right so that's a quick little first look at this new feature and i'll see you guys in the next video take care